Hello everyone, Green Gemini here, back with your next episode of City Skylines Springwood. Uh, so I figured we'd change course a little bit today, as you can see in the title of the video. We're going to allow the city to kind of grow a little bit and get going. Um, I want to address a couple of comments that were in the last video. And they were, let's see, from Naomi. You said that we could drop the park fee uh, in order to get more people to go in there, which I actually really like that idea. Um, so instead of it being 10, let's go ahead and drop it down to 5. Um, mostly because, I mean, I think 5 is good, you know, for, for this area. I don't think we need to go any lower than that, though. Um, so we're good there. And then the other comment was that we could put bushes, rocks, and trees in these empty spaces to fill it up. Uh, and then we might want to add a cargo train station later on, which I do plan on doing uh, at some point. Either the cargo train station will go over here to then disperse over into this area, or... It'll just come direct from over here. I think it's going to be best if it just comes direct from over here. Maybe. I don't know. We'll, we'll kind of see. Um, I mean, what I'd like to do is I'd really like to get this done, but I can't do anything really with that yet until I get that area unlocked. Um, so today what I want to do is I want to focus a little bit on some transportation. And with that transportation, we're going to put some ferries in here. We want to get some people going back and forth across the river on ferries. We want to get some ferry docks coming in down this way. And then we actually already have a ferry lane that goes in the canal itself. So I want to be able to utilize that too. I think that's going to be a lot of fun. Plus, we also have the opportunity to have um, some ferries to go. Like we can put one. Well, we'll. Let's just let's just figure this out, okay? Let's <laughs> let's just take a look at this. So looking at ferries. Um let's see, cargo hub, cargo harbor, and a harbor. Okay, we don't need any of that. Uh ferry depot. So we need a depot first, right? Yes. So you have to have a depot, and then the depot can go. Uh, da, da, da. Let's go ahead and put the depot here. Actually, let's let's do this. Um, I want the depot to be kind of flat. You know, I want it to be. I want it to go straight across. Uh, so let's do this. We're gonna flatten this area out here. We're gonna choose. Let's go take the brush size up a little. Flatten the land, and let's say we'll go with uh, that height. Take the brush size down just a tad. And if we go to here, I think that's that's about what I want. Let's go like that. Let's kind of flatten this out a little bit more. Now is that gonna go is that too high? Or too low, I mean? No, I don't think so. I don't think so. I think I think that'll work. Okay, so let's continue this out. Hang on, let's pause this. Let's get rid of that because that's just gonna get in the way. Okay, go back to this. Okay. So if I go like that, then we should be able to then just take this depot and kind of stick it right in come on come on there bingo whoa okay all right so ferry depot is in and then we can go ahead and do let's see some regular regular roads regular road regular road let's do a grass line road so i'll have that go to there and then that can hook up to that and then we'll go ahead and place in a couple of parking lots down here. Um, let's see. So we'll go parking lot four by four. Okay, so one, two. Cannot build on water. Talk on it. We'll go away. <laughs> the water needs to go away. Bye bye. I'm sure it'll go away eventually. Okay, so from here, 
I think what we want to do then is we want to have a fairy depot. Uh, so a fairy stop can go here. We want to pay attention to the noise level here. And I'm okay with this going at an angle on this one. Because I actually really like where that goes. Um, let's go ahead and do a fairy depot. Oh, that's going to be perfect. Or a fairy stop, I should say. That's hooked directly into that. I love that. Okay, where else can we put one here? Um, do we want to put it next to the residential area? Probably not. Um, I think it's going to be best if maybe we have one here next to this area. Let's see, we've got the library right there. We have this going in that direction here. So maybe we go... Let's add one here. I'm definitely going to add one into here. Let's see. So we have a fairy pier, which is a large fairy stop with room for two fairies at once. Connect fairy stops at piers. Mm. We might want to do that one because if we continue down this way, well, no, 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 no. I think we actually want that to be here. So if we put the pier here, then this will kind of act as a transfer to where people can go from this one to that one to that one to that one. So let's get rid of that one, yes. Noise level isn't that bad. So we'll add it there. Okay. And then let's go with a... Fairy stop here next to this. It'll go right there. And then we will go ahead and do a fairy stop right there as well. Let's see. We can leave that. I don't necessarily, I don't need to have a fairy stop over here because we're not utilizing that that much. Okay, I'm good with that. All right, so then why don't we go ahead and take this and just connect it directly to that one. Okay. And then this one. Let's go ahead and bring it out that way. Okay. Now this... Yeah, hang on. And that's gonna go... Get rid of that. Get rid of this. As far as I know, there's not really a whole lot of pollution going on down here. Okay. So then this one can go... Let's have it go along the shoreline. Like this, under the bridge. Ooh, please fit under the... Ooh, boy. Please fit under this bridge here. Actually, I want this to go that way, like that. And then off to the side over there. I like that. Okay. And really, this one just kind of needs to go like... Let's go up a little like that. And that's really just kind of going to go like that. Um, check electricity because I know I've cut a lot of it off. Yep, I did. That can connect to that. Ooh. Or not. Okay, let's have you come down to here and then connect up to there. That is all connected together, so you can go away. That can go away. Wonderful. Okay, electricity is fine everywhere else. Yes. All right, is that enough for... Yeah, that gets us our, our fairies in here. I can't believe I haven't done fairies sooner. Then again, I mean, it. the city wasn't really big enough, I don't feel like. I really don't. Um, we do need a fairy stop over here, though. So with this stuff here, why don't we have 
Yeah, because the train goes from downtown. We need a ferry stop to go here from across the river. Um, no. Yes. That's what I want. So why don't I actually... Can, can I attach this to here? I can. It's a little awkward, but it works. There we go. Actually, can we take this and... Ooh, I want I want to rotate it. And just leave it like it is. Okay. And then honestly, this is going to be a very easy cross the river type deal. And that's it. <laughs> like that's all there needs to be. Um I think I think I think I think Get rid of that. Yeah. Yeah, cross the river type deal and that's it. Alright, so let's go ahead and put um, our actual routes in here. So we're going to go from this one to that one and back. That's just going to be a simple cross the river jump. And then we're going to go create, ooh, create new line from here to there to this one. Yep, you're going to go in here. And then back this way to that one to that one. Okay. And then we'll go from this one all the way through here to that one. And then all the way back through to this one. So we have three lines. So our third line, we're actually going to call the... Uh, canal line well we're gonna have two canals and we're gonna have are we gonna have this coming through this canal probably at some point yes we will um so we're gonna call this the north canal route so let's go into here ferry line number three uh-huh and we'll change that color to let's go pink yeah i like that so north canal And then we're going to say, we're going to call this one the river root. Uh, I guess I should say root. And then fair line one is going to be river crossing root. All right, two stops, vehicles, three, three. Okay. Now, granted, it's going to take a minute for these vehicles to get over here, but they'll get over there eventually. <laughs> so, uh, colors, right. Um, so, across the river, I think we're going to go with, um, what are we going to go with? Blue, probably. Let's see, river crossing route, yeah. Let's go with, like, a really nice blue color. There you go. All right, so we'll give that a little bit of time to kind of see how people enjoy that. Uh, we are having death issues over here, and that reminds me, I completely forgot about all services that are needed <laughs> over in this area. Shocker. All right, so clinic. Uh, give me... Not a cemetery. Actually, I think I'm going to go with two of those. Yeah. And then I'll place another one over here. Mm. Actually, let me place one. No, there's no easy place to put one over here. There really isn't. All right, I'm going to leave it alone. Those two should suffice for this area for now. Okay. Uh, fire services. Oh my gosh. That's horrible. Which of course, the best one that fits in here is this one. So we'll add that one. And then police protective services. Just put it right next to put all the services right there in a row. Uh, we have no schooling over here. That's something I completely forgot about. So regular elementary school. To put there. And then a city high school. Let's 
go ahead and put the high school here. High school really only covers like half this area, but it'll work for now. Probably need to have one on each side of this city area. All right. You only have a demand for industry, not for anything else. Very, very happy with these boats that are in here with these ferries. Lovely. Oh, it's a it's the color of it, too. I love that. I don't know if that's something new or if that's something they added. I don't know for sure. Ooh, this is not a good look. They, they need to change the camera position on this. That does not work for me. No. We have a follow button though, right? Yeah. Yeah, so we can follow it if we want to. Okay. I love how the boats just kind of stack on top of one another. Okay, so anyway, uh, line details. 114, not bad. Give me... Let's see, give me this... No. Just go into here and then look at our line details from this point. Let's see. On this one, we've got... No one. No one whatsoever. So we might want to go down to two boats. I think we'll go down to two for now, just to kind of save money. Uh, the second one, definitely a decent amount of people riding that one. And then the first one... Yeah, okay. There's, we have, what, one boat? And we have about 50 people. Almost 50 that got on there. There's, whoa, really? 76 people. I love it. Absolutely love it. We might have to add a second boat onto here. We might. He's just waiting to, to dock here. We also might need to have a larger... Uh, oh, huh. I guess it would help if I connected the street. Right. It looks like it's going to be like a one, probably. Let's see if we go there to there. Three and three. Nah, no, you can't really do a three. It's fine. Do that though. All right. We'll have that go to there. Okay. And then we can actually do. Um, let's go ahead and just put some offices in here. Just kind of fill in the space, but also to. I don't know. Kind of, kind of add some stuff in here. Um, okay, we're having a problem with death right now. Death care. Deceased 888. Ouch. All right, we have no crematoriums over here. And the cemeteries are probably getting close to full, so let's add one here, one here. Crematoriums are a little bit. Do they add? Do they? Do they create pollution? Hmm, surprisingly, no. They don't. Even though I think technically in real life they do. Crematorium here. Okay, so that should help kind of take care of this area here. We have... Wow, no death care over here whatsoever. So we'll add two crematoriums. There. Of course, nothing will go there. I think I'm okay, actually, with just doing those two. Alright, so we'll do that. Uh, over here in this area... I thought I had a couple crematoriums over here, but I guess not. Huh, interesting. Alright, crematorium. And... Wow. Crematorium. I'm trying not to build too much in the actual, like, residential spots. Oh boy, we uh, <laughs> we went down to sixty-five thousand in population. Whoops, that's uh, that's my fault for you know not paying attention to our death in the city. I had a feeling that was going to happen. 
All right, so the dead are being taken care of. Once they get cleared out, we'll have more people move in. This is the way life works. Okay. Mm, and I wouldn't necessarily call that a death wave. It was just more of I didn't take care of the dead when needed. You know? So. Yeah. That's okay. It'll be alright. Give me another one over here. Get rid of, like, that one. And that should help. I don't have anything over here. Let's put one there. May not be the best to put it on there, but oh well, it's okay. I honestly think that's going to be it for today. <laughs> I mean, I didn't really want to get into a whole lot today. I think that in itself was perfect. We're not going to have much of a need for residential for a while because of all of the death that happened. Um, so we've got plenty of space for people to move into once the uh, the, the death gets taken care of. Um, you know, the dead bodies get cleared out, I should say. So I know morbid, but it is what it is. Uh, next episode, I think we will go ahead and try and work a little bit on this. More than likely going to go into a time lapse with this to kind of get the uh, the lay of the land out here and everything. Um, I want to be able to utilize the warehouses that we have available in here. Um, so we have medium, small, and large warehouses. Uh, and then we also have a bunch of these. So we have an industrial steel plant. We have an electronics factory, clothing factory, uh, car factory, all of these factories, right? I think having the factories right here would be really beneficial um, to put some of those in here. So we'll put the working factories in here with the office buildings. And then we'll have the shipping lanes that are out here because we'll have goods going to and from the factories. Uh, goods will be coming from this area here. Goods will be coming from over here. Uh, we do need to increase some of our production and what we're doing here with the forestry industry. Um, we are at two stars over here. So we actually need to get back to doing that as well. I'm going to have to start making some notes on what we need to get accomplished. Uh, forestry worker barracks. Um, we probably have enough output products definitely we just need more workers workers is what is where our upgrades are going to come from over here we've actually pretty much filled this area out in elm district we are done there um, we just need to fill in a tiny bit more here and i think we're going to add just a few offices so let's take that to there that can come down and go to there Take that out. And then let's just add offices into the rest of this. So we'll go all the way through here. There, here. Just there. And then... Yeah, we'll do that and then fill the rest of that in. There you go. Perfect. So that'll fill this area in with offices. Uh, we do need to get um, this area right here expanded out as well. Um, not entirely sure how we're going to do that yet, but I like the idea of just taking the rest of this right here and making it these water treatment plants so we can get rid of all the nasty sewage that's coming out. You don't have to worry about all that, right? Um, and there you go. Traffic flow is at 78%. That's interesting. I was wondering about that earlier. I'm kinda, I don't know why that came up. I think a lot of it just has to do with congestion and the amount of traffic that is in here. Like, there's a lot of traffic down here. A lot of traffic. What other areas have a ton of traffic in it? Right here. What is this? Interesting. The company. Hmm. Wow. Look at all the people. <laughs> it's a lot of people. 
Okay. Oh, oh, I totally forgot. I did figure out the issue with the trains. It was a despawn issue. It was a total despawn issue, so I had to enable despawning. I'm kind of sad about it. But, oh well. I'm just going to have to deal with it. It's not like we're having that many issues anyway. So. Alright, questions, comments, concerns, you guys know what to do. Put it in the comment section down below. I'm really glad we got fairies up in here. I really am. Uh, let's take one quick look at how many. Right now, we're saying 155 regular residents per week, 25 tourists per week. It'll go up. It will. It'll go up. Um, so, yeah. Uh, anything else that you want to see in the series, go ahead and put it in the comment section down below, too. We've got our campus area that we're going to put in over here, which we could start a little bit on. Uh, we're going to have to get the train through here in a different way. Uh, but we'll have campus over here. We'll have factories over here. Do we have oil anywhere? That's ore. No oil. We might throw oil in over there so we can actually do it. <laughs> we'll see. All right. But that is all I have for you guys today. So thank you so much for watching, everyone. And I'll see you next time.